Hey, thank you for joining me for this meditation of how to feel rich in alignment with Mother Earth. I'd like you to imagine yourself waking up in your dream house that you know is in harmony with Mother Earth. You've thought about this dream house for a while and you've wondered what is a house or dwelling that will not harm Mother Earth, that would not harm any other creatures. And you did your research, you asked other people who's also thinking about the same thing or have already built their own dream house. But you know you've in this dream house you are also consider Mother Earth's dream. And in, in your in your heart, home, home is Mother Earth. And so you wake up in this dream house, you're finally there. You were able to build it with your community, friends and families who have been also doing the same work of reconnecting with Mother Earth and um, you wake up in it and you just feel so aligned you just feel so connected you feel like finally you're not in the old house or apartment that you know are just producing trash and just using water and um fire and other resources in a very unsustainable way and you you're here you figured it out and it just feels so good to finally breathe in air that's fresh you know to finally have water straight from a clean stream and fire that's actually um, made straight from <laughs> a wood stove and not from gas and um, you're able to walk around the neighborhood uh, without using your car so much and you were you and your community were able to figure this out and you wake up and just waking up with that thought and that reality already makes your day and so you wake up you look at the sun, you greet the sun, you say hi, thank you for rising up with me. And you just feel gratitude for everything, for all the good things that are happening and also all the legwork that you've been doing to make things better. And today you thought about um, you thought about what to do because there's really no need to go to work <laughs> because you are now living in this new earth of full of bounty and everyone is taking care of mother earth no one's hoarding resources everyone just takes what they need for the day and they and then they give back by cultivating earth and stewarding earth and all her creatures and so you know every day you wake up there's always going to be bounty waiting for you there's always going to be food and all the beautiful things that your community creates in alignment with um in harmony with mother earth and you're excited to just share what you've created too and you're excited because you know what whatever you've created you've considered the um, impact on mother earth and you know there's not gonna be any harm or there's gonna be very very little if any and you're just so excited maybe that's what you'll do you'll just create with your friends or think about what else to do or what new skill to learn from the indigenous traditional practices that were already in harmony with earth and and you know sometimes that you don't even need to recreate things because 
Mother Earth has already taught the wisdom to peoples way, 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 way in the past. And so you're like, hmm, what am I going to do today? And you just tap into your body and tap into your feeling and your emotions and to who you are and you're reconnecting to the butterfly that you are designed to be and and i want you to ask yourself right now what are you inherently drawn to is it singing is it dancing is it making things is it creating things art or talking with people, socializing, helping people, helping the community? Is it building a sustainable house? Is it building transportation that's also sustainable? Is it farming? Is it um, taking care of animals? What are you drawn to that is also taking care of Mother Earth? And imagine yourself walk uh, getting up and thinking about doing what you want to do and obviously before you go out you go to the food area of your dwelling and see what um, food you have there that was harvested in your community and maybe this today you want to share this breakfast to your community and you're bringing um, food for them you're cooking and bringing food for them and sharing it with them and you know that others will do the same and you know there's going to be a lot of food <laughs> and you're just excited for the day and um, and then finally you decide what you're going to do and after you've cooked your meals, you go to the community area where you share food around the fire um, that keeps you warm in the mornings because it's kind of cold in the morning. Uh, you bring your food there and some of the food still needs to be cooked and you can cook it on the fire. And other people come by too to share um, breakfast and you all share breakfast together in around the warmth of the fire and you share what you want to do for the day and um, and others uh, you hear what other people plan to do for the day and you also think about like you know just playing together and just having a good time or visiting a creek or a river or maybe visiting other villages to get to know other people there and create create or recreate more stuff that are just amazing and just and nourishes everyone in our community and nourishes mother earth and all the creatures and it just feels so good for for um this type of life to have this life and you you think to yourself this is life this is how simple it should be we just laugh and have a good time and express ourselves just like how butterflies do they just fly freely and express themselves through their own designs and they play with other butterflies and they enjoy the bounty and at the same time they pollinate the mother earth as you pollinate your community with the things that you contribute and just being there being who you are and bringing who you are to the community is enough and with all the things that you create and steward as a community you know that the same life will be available to the next seven generations and your heart is just filled with happiness and joy knowing that the circle of life is finally balanced and we can now have a good time and you deserve it and by living this life of bounty 
and richness and not just of resources but of happiness and love that you are serving the world you are bringing justice and happiness and well-being and peace and harmony to the whole world and this is what richness means um, that's aligned with mother earth and so you can always go back to this type of life and imagine it and think about and tweak it based on your own intuition um, I welcome you to always come back and just play with a new reality of a rich life that is for everyone and now you can um, go back to um, to where you are your room uh, you can wiggle your fingers and um, when you're ready you can open your eyes and bring this new imagination to your day and maybe take little steps to make it a reality because it's just waiting for us so thank you for listening for this meditation i hope that you enjoyed it and i hope to be with you again soon bye